What's going on, everybody? I know who it is, the JJ. You know we back at it like an addict, no rehab, because you know I'm addicted to giving you guys all this advice that you're going to need. So, you know, I picked y'all. Know y'all seen a video of me picking up the $300 Buick uh, from the auction. So, this video just want to be short and simple. You know, I don't want it to be too long. It's uh, it's just going to be a video showing you what some $20 hubcaps can do to transfer a car, and you know how to, you know take a good picture at, a, at an angle you know to market the vehicle a little bit so let's get into it Look at that. Y'all see this ugly little, ugly little Buick. You know, it looks a little ugly right now. You know, this is the good side though. Tire's in good shape though. You know, tire a little low, but we'll we air that up. See this? Y'all hear it? Sounding good, you know, quiet. You know, go, I can go get that. That ain't nothing, I can get that, that's nothing. But y'all see, it's got a little, this is where the damage is. The windows rolled down just so I don't lock myself out. But you know, somebody took the time to put tires on this thing. So you know, it's got some damage right there. But look at that, it started sounding good. We're gonna take, we're gonna make sure, we're gonna get all this off the window. Get those, get a window motor. That ain't nothing, that stuff you can get at the salvage yard. So I'm gonna just show y'all. 521. So you know somebody was driving it not too, not too long ago. You know, we are driving it. But look at that. We, it's kind of, it's a little ugly right now, but we have to put these hubcaps on there and show y'all what it looked like after some just after just after putting some twenty dollar hubcaps on there. So. I know a lot of y'all probably looking like, oh man, that's a beat up car. Yes, yes, it's a little beat up on the other side, but it's a, it's gonna be it's gonna make somebody a good cheap running car. So you know, as y'all know in the video, I bought it for you know what I buy. I bought it for three hundred. So. I'm gonna invest, you know, 50, 100 bucks, you know, getting the oil change, get to get some window motors, clean it up, clean it out, you know, have about $400 in there, flip it for $800, you know, that's gonna, like I said, then this, I'm gonna use this car, like I said, I already showed y'all in a previous video flipping the car, so this car, I'm gonna use that money, you know, that 400, I'm gonna use that to pay for the trailblazer that's at Mako getting the paint job put on it. So y'all, it's, it's all coming in one. So now I know a lot of y'all might look at it, man, that's an ugly little car, but this this is gonna be somebody's, this car is gonna be somebody's car and it's gonna be running. Somebody's gonna get, somebody's gonna get you, you're gonna get a running car for $800. You you can barely go to the auction and buy a car running for $800. So you're gonna get a car for $800 that you're able to come look at beforehand. You're able to come test drive it, make sure you like it. You're able to check everything and it's going to be cleaned down and stuff, you know, that's the window motor, and I'm going to clean it up, and I'm going to clean it up some more detail, you know, it's a little ugly, rough right now, but let me just put this hubcaps on it, then we're going to walk around there and just show you what some hubcaps will do to a vehicle. Look at that, y'all hear it. Quiet, ain't it? Y'all hear it. We up close on it, y'all hear it. Look at that. Got good tires, they ain't, gonna, they ain't gotta worry about no tire. Look at that, Fred, great on that tire. Bam. Bam. Now look at it. Still, you know, because it ain't cleaned up yet, but see what just some hubcaps just do to a vehicle, you know. Look at that. Oh yeah, you get it, get it from right here from this angle, right there. Bam. Right there. That's the angle right there. Look, look at that. That's the angle you look at it right there. Bam. Yeah, I gotta learn how to take some pictures too. Y'all gotta get down right there. Then bam, you'll get down there right there. You'll take a picture right there at that angle right there. Bam. Have the person like, man, that's a nice car. Let me let me go see what it's about. You know, they're gonna look at the other side, be like, yeah, the other side a little rough. But I mean still, you get down there, bam, take a you get that headlight right there fixed. Bam. Take that tape and stuff off the window. Look what some hubcaps do to the vehicle. Now it looks completely different. Looks like a change view. Y'all see that? Look at it. Look at it. Once it's washed up too, you know, once it's washed. So just imagine, it looks, it looks already looks better from 
you know, what it looked like already. Y'all know how it is. Y'all know perception is everything. You know, people like look first thing first, you know, paper, people looking off the look of the car, you know. You know, I could once it's cleaned up, you know, if it didn't have those hubcaps on it, people be like, maybe, you know, maybe they'll look at it. A lot of times, I mean, but on this car, the price is going, the price is going to be the price is going to be the selling point on this car. And I'm just showing you like what some hubcaps can do, make a car and make a car look better. And also, you know, you gotta you gotta learn how to take pictures. You know, you gotta make you gotta make your car look better and stand out. So, y'all 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 gotta make the car look better and stand out. But this car. The price is gonna sell itself. Uh, like I said, you know, uh, I'm gonna sell this car. You know, eight nine hundred. Somebody's gonna get them a running car for eight nine hundred bucks. You know, working working people say like, hey man, I got me a car running and driving for eight nine hundred bucks. You know, heat working, AC working. I know a lot of y'all probably looking at it like, oh man, that car is beat up. It's ugly and stuff like that. I wouldn't drive it. You know, hey, doesn't matter if you wouldn't drive it. It's somebody out there that needs a, some reliable transportation. You know. Oh, or some, or some of y'all might say, oh, why are you selling that uh, beat up, ugly car or whatever, you know? Like, first off, you know, hey, a car is a car. Like, once you've been in the business, as long as I have, man, a car start being a car. And I know it's a lot of people that just need cars to go to point A to point B. So, you know, somebody's gonna get them a car that's running and driving. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna clean it. It's gonna be all cleaned up, you know? I'm gonna clean it up, get the oil changed, get the little window motor, so. Y'all know I paid 300 bucks for it. I mean, all that stuff probably gonna cost me about 100 bucks. So I have about $400 invested into the car. I'll sell it for eight, 900. So I'll make four or 500. Use that money to pay for the for the paint job on the Trailblazer. But somebody's gonna get them a good re running reliable car. You know, for 800 bucks. You know, they ain't have, they don't have to they ain't gonna have to make no payments on it. They're gonna be riding. You know, yeah, it's got a little damage on there, but you can fix. That, but think about it, the little damage that's on there, you can fix that up later if you wanted to. You know what? Go to the salvage yard, get you a fender. Really, cause that's, only, that's the only really damage is the fender. Cause I'm gonna go to the salvage yard and get the little headlight for him. So, you know, get you a fender. Yeah, you got a little dent in your door, but get you a fender, clean it up some, clean, it's already gonna be cleaned up, but get you a fender really, then what else? Cause you're, you're gonna have windows. So it's really just the fender. So somebody gonna get them a good car, you know, I could, I could sell it like that and still get 800, but why? You know, fix the fix the minor stuff. You know, when you buy cars, always think about when you buy cars, always look at it like, when I'm buying cars, I'm gonna have to invest, in, you know, minimum $100, $200 into a car, you know, depending on, you know, when you gotta, de some cars are dirty, so you might gotta detail it. You probably gonna have to buy some parts to it. You know, so just, uh, just think of, you know, just know you're gonna have to invest some money into the car, but look what this look. So this is what, so 300, $200 hubcap, I mean, $20 hubcap, not 200. I would never spend that much for a hubcap. I wouldn't even spend that much for no rims. But look at that, $20 hubcaps. Boom, I'm gonna clean it up myself. So what, $5 for me to vacuum it out and you know, take it to the car wash and wash it off. Go get that headlight from the salvage yard. That's probably gonna cost about ten dollars window motor get a window motor because the back windows roll down the fronts don't so get two window motors at the salvage yard about ten dollars a piece 20 20 25 dollar oil change and bam somebody's gonna be riding in a nice buick for under a thousand dollars you're gonna get a running car for under a thousand dollars so